The idea of a warp drive comes from Einstein's general relativity, which shows that space-time can be curved and stretched. Instead of moving through space at faster than light speeds, a warp drive would work by compressing space in front of a ship and expanding it behind, creating a warp bubble that carries the ship along. This would mean that the ship itself isn't actually moving faster than light. Space itself is doing the moving. One of the most famous theoretical models for this is the Alcubierre drive, proposed by physicist Miguel Alcubierre in 1994. His equations showed that faster than light travel might be possible, but there's a huge problem. It would require an exotic form of negative energy, something that we don't know how to create. To make a warp bubble, we would need a material with negative mass or a way to manipulate space-time in a way that modern physics does not currently allow. Some scientists think that small-scale warp effects might be possible in the future. NASA has even experimented with tiny distortions in space using high-energy physics. But we are nowhere near building an actual warp drive. If negative energy or exotic matter were discovered, it could change everything. But so far, these remain purely theoretical. For decades, physicists have suspected that the four known forces might not be the full picture. The standard model of particle physics, which describes the fundamental building blocks of the universe, is incredibly successful. But it's also incomplete. It doesn't explain dark matter, doesn't include gravity in a quantum framework, and doesn't account for why the universe is expanding at an accelerating rate. These gaps have led many scientists to believe that there may be an additional, undiscovered force at work. If this theory is true, it could radically change our understanding of space, time, and even consciousness itself. It might help explain some of the deep puzzles in physics, such as why gravity behaves differently from other fundamental forces. Some physicists even speculate that reality itself could emerge from this underlying holographic structure